Hello there. Greetings from Moline, Illinois. This is Max Anderson. I'm 22 years old, and I just wanted to share with you guys today a few videos of me leading worship from our church's sermon live stream, uh, and then also a few of me just sitting here with my guitar, singing to you straight through my phone. I also want to tell you a little bit about my walk with the Lord, some fun facts about me, um, and just what God's been up to in my life lately. So thank you for your time, and I'll be right back with you in just a minute. He knows what living is, he's acquainted with our grief, a man of sorrow, son of suffering, hope oh, Fun facts about me. Uh, number one, I love Mexican food. I could eat Mexican food every day, and I do eat it just about every day. It's super easy to cook. 
Um, I've also become a huge fan of the art of salsa making. I love making salsa from scratch, roasting the peppers myself. Um, I love a good cilantro lime salsa verde. Um, I could put that on just about anything. A good steak quesadilla. Mm. Make my day. So good. Number two, I really love basketball. I've been playing basketball since I was a little kid. I played through high school. I love to watch it. Um, and I especially love just getting to hang out with some buddies and play uh, shoot hoops and do all that. Um, just kind of takes you back to simpler times before taxes and work and all that. So, um, so I love getting to play some basketball. And uh, just me as a person, um, I really love getting to know people and make friends. Um, one of my favorite things to do is just get dinner with my friends or with someone who I don't know yet. Um, just the idea of sitting down with someone and getting to hear their story, how their day was, what they like and don't like, their favorite foods. Like, I just love getting to know people. Um, yeah, I think it's one of the gifts that God's given me as a person is just um, being a good hang, being able to talk to people and meet them where they are. Um, so yeah, that's just a little bit about me. The condition I was in I was lost, alone, and hopeless A captive by my sin When I hit rock bottom He was there with open arms. That is why I praise Him. Good Shepherd, great reward. Abba Father Brought in morning star He's my creator Redeemer Savior and my friend Thy is why I praise Him. Have you seen His great compassion for the broken and the Have you heard his gentle voice? Have you seen my father dance when the prodigal comes home? That is why I praise Him. Oh, that is why I praise Him. Good.
good shepherd, great reward, above Bright and morning star is my creator, redeemer, savior, and my friend. That is why I pray. So just a little bit about my walk with the Lord. Um, I grew up in a Christian home. Uh, both of my parents were on staff at our church my whole childhood. Um, so I spent a lot of time there growing up and went to Christian school all my life. So I grew up with a lot of Bible knowledge. Um, but it wasn't until I was about 17 that I really decided that Jesus was going to be Lord of my life. Um, and he drastically changed me and turned my life around, um, delivered me out of my depression and my insecurities. Um, I spent a lot of time seeking my self-worth in girls and relationships, trying to numb the pain with alcohol. And um, he delivered me out of all of that. Um, so I've really experienced what it means that Jesus delivered me from my sins. Um, and uh, yeah, I would say in college was when I really started to take the spiritual discipline seriously of just getting in the scriptures every day, of spending time in prayer. And it was as I made those disciplines a point that the desire followed. Um, and I just saw my desire for Jesus grow and grow so much. Um, and the farther I've walked with him, the more I've realized just how much sin he delivered me out of um, and just how wicked I was when he died for me. Um, and as he's revealed that to me, uh, my surrender has just grown so much uh, to say, Lord, my talents, my time, my money, you know, whatever I have, all of me, like, it's yours. I was a slave to sin, and you paid my debt, and so everything that I am, Lord, um, you can have all of me. Um, so it's been, a, it's been a long journey of the Lord just sanctifying me and um, teaching me over the years, and I still have plenty of room for improvement. Um, but I'm just so thankful for Jesus and for the gospel.